Indeed, Ria. No boobs in sight. Hi, my name is Vitamin D. Stan. Welcome back to some King Koi. I was about to say. I was about to say. Let's get started. That sequence must have been the end of it. We had ne we had nearly watched the whole movie last time, and that was where we picked back up from. Even though it was easier for Ria to see a TV screen, she couldn't perceive the character's complex movements. Right now, she couldn't see that the heroine was about to be on her deathbed. She didn't know French, so she couldn't understand. Yeah. But her mind was sharp, so she could infer to an extent. Should we stop? I wouldn't stop it if you're insistent, but it did make me feel awful to watch it. Why? Because your girlfriend could be on her deathbed soon, too? It reminded me of Rhea, or maybe I wouldn't go that far, but still. Hmm. Yeah, they're saying, I love you. <laughs> Rio snorted. If lovers found themselves in such a scenario in real life, I didn't think this was about all that would come up. The course of events led to the heroine passing away, and the protagonist set out on a journey to deliver the parcel he received from her to her mother. Then, the credits rolled. The music changed, so she probably realized it was over, but Rio didn't say a word. This was the first movie she saw after leaving the hospital. We screwed up choosing this one. Just as I was feeling terrible. She slumped her weight against me and plopped into my lap. Yeah, you mentioned that before. I pat her head. Hmm. I didn't think it was an awful movie, personally. But it sounded like Rhea, someone who had lived her whole life on the brink of death, had watched something else entirely. Well, I never thought about it in that way, but I get where she's coming from. <laughs> それが終わるだけで死ぬことから何か感じてほしいとは思わねえわ。Sorry, none of this makes sense to me. Might upset her, but I told her the truth. わかんなくていいよ。うん、一生わからない方がいい。でも一、せめてお前だけは、俺をこの映画みたいには見ないで。What do you mean? 俺を死ぬものだと思って見ないで。今ちゃんと生きてる俺だけ見てて多分辛くなると思ういつか疲れて俺はもう半分死んでるってそういうものだって思っちゃう時が来ると思うよでもそんな時は思い出して俺は生きてる限りは生きてる生きてる限り俺
I knew what she wanted to say. Did I read that right? Even so, I was petrified. I had to be. This would make for some intense exercise. Wasn't that best avoided? But. Well, I guess. Only because we were kids. あ、<笑><笑> So then, I would do it, even if I made, even if it made me regret it for the rest of my life in the end. I would throw everything else away if I meant I could be the cool boyfriend she needed me to be. Mm. Oh. I leaned over and gave her another kiss. Listen, tell me right away if you started to feel sick. Don't overexert yourself. Oh, they're not running, are they? <laughs> then, your heart may have been mine for the past 10 years. But today, I'll make your body mine too. Oh, god dang. Oh, boy. Let him know that it's Maria Bishop this entire time. And they do the smash and nice. What if it's so good that she dies? That'd be kind of crazy, huh? <laughs> what? It's because they had sexy time and she wasn't part of it. Ria, what's up? You're staring. <laughs> Me too. You're so cute, Ria. What the fuck? <laughs> oh. Oh. <笑>恋人になったのなら、イチャイチャ、ネチャネチャなさるの大変結構。<笑> あ。いや、でやれ。でで、ウォリミン。こいつが間仕切れしたのは久しぶりだ。エスカシーズナーゲティングエニアクション、アイムテリングユ。ウェネバーズレイナズルー、シーワズノーワーニアダットスパイス。
All right, all right, all right, that's enough. She sure is. I agree. Somehow she came out to be the most loving out of the entire, the entire group of heroines in this game. Which is very shocking to me. I am so uncomfortable right now. I don't know how I feel about this. And I like it, you know. It's adorable. But, again, it's off-putting. Because she's always spicy. Now she's not spicy. Not at all. Don't answer that. I know. It was a rhetorical. ところでさっき市松さんのこと一って呼んでた。市松オーロ。下品な庶民の分際であのかっこいい一君と同じあだ名なんて。あ。名前き。What?こんにちは。She Ah, uh, hey! Don't bite my ear. Oh, that's so embarrassing. Why you... Umph. Blocking the mouth is a highly effective way of competing with an animal adversary. And that's why I'm going to gobble your whole mouth right up. Kisses it. What's <laughs> You're here. It seemed we had guests. They originally had plans abroad this weekend, but they cut their trip short when they heard Rio was out of the hospital. <laughs> That's the dumbest question you could have asked. You're looking at them right now. What do you mean? Hey, no, watch out. Whoa. Now she leapt at me too. I caught her. Unlike Rio, Sylvie had a moderate amount of weight to her. And her large biddies bashed into me at full force. I didn't do none. Why are you mad at me? I sat up. And then... Ryo immediately got pushed back down all over again. She auto-recovered through the power of love. That's exactly what I was thinking. Oh, man. So dumb. Nah, but literally. I wanted to tell Sylvie as soon as possible, so I spilled the beans up front. Sylvie immediately got the hint and flashed the beaming smile. <laughs> oh yeah, did you know Rio's had a thing for me since then? She was all over me just a short time ago, though. I guess Rio was embarrassed when other people were around. You loved me that much. So he said with a gigantic smirk. Rio blushed and glared bitterly at Sylvie for being so outspoken in her steed. Oh, that reminded me. Stare. Oh, since she mentioned it, yeah, your hair does seem similar. Oh, I <laughs> So is her, it's pretty, isn't it? Oh, no. no, don't do it. Just because of a haircut? That's actually crazy. We were using Sylvie's hair as a wig was a sensitive subject, but it sounded like Alison was fully in the loop. Oh. You think Sylvie cared though? No. Tokuni,当時は養子縁組の関係で、シスワ家へ伊スタ家が非常に敏感になっていた時期、色へという私の兄など、これはシスワ家への当て付けではないかと言い出して、一時が国政にも影響がでかねない状況でした。Just a hairc
I had no idea what she meant by adoption, but I assumed there had been a lot of commotion at the national level. And of course, we know what she means by the adoption. So we brushed through her hair fluently. To cut such long, beautiful hair would be a big deal if you asked me, but she was in high spirits for some reason. Those two got along so well. The other son was all smiles as she watched from the sidelines. I was happy too. Yay, we're all happy. It's time for Silver to return to the estate and Ellie ushered her along. Yeah. It seemed she'd be able to make it again starting tomorrow too. She felt like a skipaholic who'd gotten her hands on a perfect excuse. We just smirked. Oh. Almost slipped there. Oh. 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 What are you talking about? She curtly turned away. Was she still hiding something? Yes. Then... Sylvia called me over. Is she gonna give us a hint? I really hope so. This guy is so dense. We walked out of the dorm. Something up? I guess she was hiding something and she quickly pulled it out. Oh, the box from before. It was the Oro Hora box. <laughs> Why are you stealing from my room? Mm -hmm. Ah, hang on a sec, Sylvie. Blank. Russell. She opened the box carelessly and the items inside, the four silver lover emblems went flying. Whoa! Thank goodness there was no wind. I immediately scrounged them up. Silver leverages. One, two. Good. That's all four. I fortunately managed not to lose any. Yeah, you exchanged a single golden emblem for her, but these are silver. You can't make a trade in with five silvers, and right now, I've got four. More or less. Of course, these are mine and Rhea's. We were two and two, and the rule was whoever pulled the last took the whole pool. Not that it mattered who pulled it now that she and I were an item, though. <laughs> yeah. The three of us met by sheer coincidence after all the trouble we'd gone through to get this box. After giving her the item inside, I became friends with Sylvie. Our little group of three unquestionably came to be thanks to this box, as well as the brand of sweets. Uh, ah. She held out a golden ring. It was the same cheap, gold-plated ring Sylvie had worn before. An item I knew she had adored. What am I on? She placed it upon the pedestal of the Orohora labeled box. She handed it to me. She seemed to be saying she was giving this golden ring to me. 
Are you sure? ええ、もちろん。最初からこの約束で私はこの指輪を作ったんだもの。はあ。<笑>ここは覚えてないじゃなくて知らないのよね。オーロ、男の子でアクセサリー教室にはいなかったもの。私とソウマくんの約束なの。これを作った時の。オーロが選んだ方が。この指輪の持ち主になるって。はあ、Did that mean? はい。She handed it over. シルビー様、そろそろ。Wait, wait. I also did not understand that fully. Let me read, read that. s o m a k u n and I made a promise back when we made these that whoever you picked would be the owner of this ring. Huh? Did that mean? Oh, they both have a crush on him, is what I'm going to assume. Interesting. Hi! And with that, their time was up. I will. And off she went. Hey, Ria.、Huh? Looks like I still don't remember much about the past at all. I set down the little hold on box. Then I took out the golden ring inside and put the leverage emblems back in. Oh, so there? Yeah. With a giggle, Ryo removed the ring atop the pendant, which hung from her chest. She gazed stoically at it, as if reminiscing on something. And... Don't worry, it already happened. So, the Anayaksoko Mamotte Moraiba. Orewa Queen Akshineta. Hey, yo, chill. Don't talk about dying. It would break my heart. Ah, cut the rio. Mons on Nakina. Ima Shinda Rakoka is ra. Zutto Zutto d i s k i n a a t s n i Skina Yoni Dakitskiran d a k a r a Right. I snuggled up to her myself. We'll make these our wedding rings. Wait a sec. Will this fit on my finger? If it was a perfect fit for Sylvie, it might be pretty tight even on my pinky finger. Ah, daijobu. So, it was a s i a on my own. What chiga size of a tokoyo? Otona nina to my no size and it's good to our car. We took the ring that had been on top of her pendant and put it on her own finger. Slack despair. Has she used it for a pendant since it was useless to her personally as a ring? Skate me, Ose. Hmm, sure. We exchanged the rings as carefree as could be. Nice! They look cool. And luckily, Sylvie's golden ring was a perfect fit for Ria's finger, and Ria's ring was a perfect match for my own. Wow, you estimated this perfectly a decade ago? That's amazing. Hadn't she said gold was the one color she could differentiate? Ryo squinted at the shiny, sparkly ring. Their golden sheen adorned both of our fingers. The engraved letters of Orohora sparkled dazzlingly. Golden time. I blessed this golden time of mine and Ryo's. That's great and all, but. I could feel the end. Very, very close. I'm a little sad. But we're not exactly done with Kinko, anyways. Just a whole other game reminder. Before we knew it, the second term would be over in a matter of days. A ton had happened in the first half of December, and I was worn out. The latter half was a winter break. I love to have spent it relaxing, since I could use plenty of that time on Ria. I thought expert planning courses were designed for me to focus on something I was interested in. If so, I would spend it on Ria. Course. I went home ahead of everyone else. This really was wrong of me, but hey, I was sure I would save face as long as I circled back to campus again around the time class let out. I went back to my place and knocked on the wall. Okay. Thanks, I'm back. She came in for the glow. <laughs> What a cutie. I hugged her back and ruffled her up a little bit. She sounded delighted. 
The thought had occurred to me recently, but her feline-esque features complement her dog-like personality. All right, bro. Now I need to call her a dog or a feline. That feeling only grew stronger the more I dotted on her. Hey, yo. You're the last person I want to hear that from. I wasn't sure why, but that did seem to be true. Was it out of concern for her condition? Who knew? Well, whatever the case may be. Today is Wednesday, so we've got a couple more days until the weekend, and then we've got the end of term ceremony on Monday. We can spend all our time together once winter break starts, Ryo. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. What are you doing over vacation? Will you go see her? So it would be tough for her to visit. I guess they still had a rather rocky relationship. That would probably be for the best then. What? Oh, that. I'm really looking forward to it. Although I had taken part in smaller celebrations, I had never been to anything you'd classify as a party before in my life. Especially not a party thrown by a princess. P -p princess. I heard the food's gonna be amazing. But it's food. Definitely something important. Hmm? Ryo was acting upset for some reason. What could it be? I knew it was a party, but we were just going to show up, eat, and it'd be over. Well, that thought filtered through my mind. Hmm? She suddenly left the room. What was going on? I quickly followed after her. <laughs> this is how he's gonna find out. <laughs> she was on the phone with someone. Given her sharp hearing, she must have heard the cell phone go off from the other room. I couldn't hear what they were discussing though. Oh, okay, never mind. Did something come up? We continued to flirt again for a while afterward. For a few hours. Later that evening, Rhea got into the car of the person who came to pick her up and headed out. I would have loved to have gone with her, but... Shut up. Hi, hi. Jogosaki was with her for who knows what reason, so I gave up on the idea. No reason to cause unnecessary conflict. By the way, as for who came to pick her up in the car... I felt like I'd seen this person somewhere before. Oh, please put it together already. Either way, I had caught a glimpse of some connections of Ria's I didn't know about. That night. You can't look down on frozen meals these days. Come on. Just as I wish... Ugh! Just as I was dishing out some of the contents of my somewhat overly packed freezer. Oh. Hey, welcome back. Ria came back after a mere two hours. It was only 8 o'clock, what happened? And after she told me she wouldn't be back until after lights out. The little This was liable to cause problems outside, so we headed in. Did something bad happen? Ryo was clearly very upset. What's wrong? Jogosaki, what happened? Tell me. This was partially the disparage Ryo for being so rowdy, but I was also simply worried. But this woman was as nasty as ever. You won't tell me? <laughs> then you leave me no choice. One press and Ryo will turn into a good, honest girl in no time. Even if she gets angry, I'll just have to push her switch that will blow the rage away in an instant. Now, where might I find Ryo's little nipple? <laughs> what? 
That's what Rio's saying, but there's a sort of switch where after one little press on the right, you'll pester me and beg me to touch the left one. There, I'm gonna press it. <laughs> she stopped this thing. Oh, look, she spilled. 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 Look, she spilled.素人の中でもメジャーに片足突っ込んでるところなの。そういうところはスタジオの管理側も引き目にするのよ。盛り上がってるんだし、空気読んだよみたいな感じで。ああ、あっちなら管理者連中も蹴散らしてやれたのに。
I'm sorry. I'm already dating a girl I love, so I'm sorry. I mean, I do think you're really, really attractive. And I legitimately think you're the prettiest person in the world. Maria lifted her head. Huh? Huh? <laughs> what? Did you guys like that? Ma, Kanojo to Steva, Zurakaita Kurai, the Mitame de Kiskanakata Tenma Mukatsu. Probably preconceived notions at play. My mind fizzled out and stopped working when Maria Bishop showed up. Ma, Omaino Kyokuruko Nitsuita, Akirameter Kedo. Sonato no Hanitora ni Kakaranakata, Mantin Dakara. Maria? No. Ria gave me a great big smile. The ordinary Ria was cute, but she was outrageously pretty when she was like this. Um, so, am I actually dreaming? Beyond a doubt. Maria Bishop Who would have thought that these two were working together? As much as I don't like the second one. The one with the... Oh, the 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 oh, organic black hair. You're saying everything I admired is a game. Jogusagi said proudly. Tegakeたも何も。てめえは勝手にネットに俺が歌ってるとこあげただけじゃねえか。始まりはね。でもその後、このビジュアルや歌の世界観に合わせたセットを作ったのは。I should probably keep my mouth shut at this point. However, what they were saying definitely made sense. Maria didn't reveal what she looked like until after her debut, after all. Why did you do that? Accidentally skipped. I'm so sorry. Let's look at the log, shall we? I wouldn't know since I didn't watch educational shows, but it was probably it's probably no one so it's popular. The genius pianist without peer, Sylvie is a featured on Japanese television at least once a year. I wouldn't know since I didn't watch educational shows, but it was probable no one so it's popularity. Mm. Oh yeah, if I recall correctly, Sylvie didn't know how to play an instrument when we were younger. She said something about having to learn an instrument when she returned to her country due to some reason, although I didn't remember the specifics. <laughs> カラオケってのも違うからちょうど仲良くなってた綾香にどっか本格的に歌えるとこないかなって聞いて私のしているスタジオを使わせてあげたんです勝手に録音しやがってあれ盗聴っつんじゃねえのか録音は勝手にされち
think it means? Do I have permission to rub the boobs of the Maria Bishop? You should have kept that to yourself, buddy. There's another woman in here. Oh no, not the role play. Whoa. It was like he was giving me a look of contempt, but I didn't care. I can hug and nozzle you? And kiss you and stuff? Does that mean I can use your bitties as a pillow? Have you smack me in the face with your ass and stuff my face between your legs and have you sit on my face while you strangle my neck with your thighs? That is crazy. <laughs> I was so turned on. I might get a nosebleed. Yeah, maybe you should have. <laughs> I don't know, man. You saw how dumb he was just now. Hmm. That reminded me. You mentioned it before, but what do you mean by Christmas? Oh, that's what I don't know. Huh, really? Wait, has Sylvie figured out who you are? I'm sure I got married to a few years ago. I was Am I just that dense? Yeah. Hey. <laughs> no hesitation. Behind that, yes. This gave me mixed feelings. Is there some problem with that? I doubt that there would be any complaints given Maria's singing voice, personally. Yeah. いや、やる。I could make an educated guess based on their banter. Maria Bishop hasn't sung publicly since around July. I've got a flawless knowledge of all things, Maria. Can you not sing? She was supposed to sing on a TV program two months ago, but ended up canceling last minute. Is that because? Hmm. まだ10日もあるんだ。シルビーには言うなよ。リア。頼む。え。And with that, there were 11 days until the performance. So began to recuperating Ria's agonizing struggle. Her crack addiction, uh, her cigarette addiction, I mean. Same thing. That's a perfect spot to end the video. What? This couldn't have been better. Holy crap. Rush, 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 rush. I'm not getting class today. I was taking a music based expert planning class. Ah, of course. Doing something with his life after finding the love of his life. Which good for him. You know, he's getting it together. Eventually. <laughs> or maybe I should say. Vocal based. How's everything going? Yes, ma'am. We're gonna wrap it up here. I wanna say it wasn't a crazy episode, but it definitely wasn't crazy. But I'm so glad that they finally told him. I feel like it was it was time. It was definitely time. And I feel like it was at a good time too, you know. It didn't feel like it was too late or too soon either. It, definitely not too soon either for sure. But I really enjoyed this episode and I really, really enjoyed his reaction. I didn't think it was going to be how it was, but I was definitely not disappointed. I knew it was going to be funny, but like, I think they did an even better job with it than I was thinking they would, if that makes sense. I think it does. But with that being said, I think that's all I got to say about this episode, except we're coming near the end of this series already. Finally, <laughs> it has been amazing and after 
almost being done with Rio's route. I could tell you that Rio's route. It's a hard, it's a hard pick if you would ask me which is the best or the top three routes because I really liked Reina. Her route wasn't the best for sure, but if we're talking about Reina as a character overall, Reina's definitely one of my favorite characters. But just Reina, Sylvie, and Rhea, man, man. But out of the best routes, I'd say Sylvia and Rio for sure have the best routes, 100%. I really like Delvis too, don't get me wrong. It's just, they were all good, all good. But Rhea's and Sylvia's are something else. They are all good, that's the problem. They're all good, but Rhea's and Sylvia's are just even better, <laughs> at least to me personally. But best girl for me, easily, easily. Probably Rhea and Reyna. It's, it's between those two. But again, Sylvia's just also really great. Anyways, I'm done. I'm done talking. I'll let you guys go. Thank you so much for watching this video of King Coin. If you did enjoy, please let me know by hitting that like. Subscribe if you haven't already done so. And next episode might actually be the last episode of the series. After this series, I'll make a poll. See what you guys want to see next. I could go back and finish Cafe Stella. Or if you guys want me to do something else, that'll also work. But again, I want to do a different series before we do King Koi Golden Time because I would like a break from King Koi. Or I might just mess around and do King Koi Golden Time right after this. I don't know. But I'm going to make a pull. So stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for the next episode. And I'll leave it at that. Thank you so much for watching once again. And I'll see you guys in the next video as always. Y'all stay safe. And until next time, hopefully the camera doesn't fall off the books. That would be really bad.